It's an alarming video to say the least. As a double amputee is seen trying to get away from police, flashing a butcher knife. But what happened next had his family in tears. My son was murdered. That's right. I don't want nobody to react on it. I just want y'all to get justice. Dorothy Lowe's son, Anthony Lowe Jr., was shot and killed by Huntington Park police officers on Thursday, just moments after a passerby shot this video. They refused to give everything that we need to know what really happened to him. He was not homeless. He was loved. And it's sad, really sad how these police are getting away with killing our African-American people just getting away with it. He was in a wheelchair. What more could he do? What more could he do? Investigators say they got a call at 345 Thursday afternoon by a man saying he was stabbed by another man in a wheelchair. When officers arrived, they say they found Lowe with a knife. They say he got out of his wheelchair and attempted to get away. In a statement, the Huntington Park Police Department says officers tried twice to deploy tasers but were unsuccessful in subduing Lowe. And after he continued to threaten officers with the knife, that's when they say an officer involved shooting happened. Be realistic about this. What could he have possibly done in the wheelchair? We want justice. And answers as friends and family say they have heard little from the police department or the LA County Sheriff, which is assisting in the investigation. You guys knew that your lives wasn't in danger? He's running on his limb. How cold hearted could they be? And while this family struggles to make sense of their loss, they are remembering a father, brother, son, and friend. He got a strong family that loves him. So I just want justice. We want justice.